Okay, here's the right leg, the right tibia. This is our spot of insertion for a proximal tibia, and this is gonna be our point of insertion for a distal tibia. We'll start here. How do I identify the proper landmark for a proximal tibia? We go two fingers below or distal to the tibial tuberosity and one finger medial, and that would be our point of insertion. Remember, this leg is just a little laterally or laterally rotated, so this is going to be uh, pointing straight up so we'd be able to insert here. It's a nice flat area, and this typically has very, very little soft tissue over it in most circumstances, and so this is why this is our primary site for IO insertion if there's no contraindication, and it's typically very, very successful. So here's the procedure for starting a proximal tibia IO. We identify the tibial tuberosity, go two fingers distal to it, go one finger medial, prep the skin, cap is removed, the site has been marked, the needle is pushed through the skin until it makes contact with the bone. The needle is now removed, properly disposed of, and the site is flush with 10 cc's of normal saline or lidocaine if this is ALS to verify placement. 